Hello, today we are going to be learning how to add questions to your GimKit Creative game. First off, make sure you are in the area where you want your questions to be. We're going to click the plus sign, click on devices, and to find it very easily, type in Q-U-E and questioner pops right up. We're going to click on that, place it where you want it. Next, we are going to add a device. We're going to type in item spawner, which is item grantor, sorry, item grantor, and put that next to your questioner. And this is going to decide for you what is their reward when they get answers correct. So I like to have cash for mine. So where it says item to grant, I'm going to type in C-A-S, and it pops right up and you set the amount that they're going to get. We're going to leave all this alone. Close that up. Next, we have to wire this. We have to make sure that the questions that are answered correctly get that money. So we're going to click the plus sign, close out devices, click on wires, and we're going to wire from the questioner to the item grantor. And now when their question is answered correctly, we're going to grant item. And we can close that up. Now we're going to format the questioner. We'll do this part last. We go to interface. And this is where we like to have the correct message. So I like to have correct and then plus, which is holding down the shift key and the plus sign, which is up near the delete button. And then I'm going to say plus $25. And when they get it wrong, I'm going to say incorrect and do minus $25. And then the only other thing we need to do to finish that out is our link. So you open up a new tab and you go to GimKit. And if you don't have kits already made, you can search kits. So right up here, click search kits. And maybe you want a division kit. Make sure you check the questions before you do. Make sure they're not too hard or too easy or off topic. So this one looks pretty good. I'm going to click on that. And then right over here, we're going to click the share button. And we're going to copy this link. Now we go back to our tab with our game and we're going to paste it. Uh, I have a MacBook, so I do Command V and that will paste it. If you're on a Chromebook, you're going to do Control, which is the button that says CTRL and then you're going to type the letter V while you hold the control button. Once that's done, I can click the X and then I want to run my game. I want to make sure that it works. And don't just answer one question, answer a couple of questions and get some wrong. And I'll show you why. So you do your question, 48 divided by 12 is four. Good, that showed up. I'm going to do another one, 14 divided by seven equals two. Great, I'm gonna do one more, eight divided by two. I'm gonna get this one wrong, I'm gonna say 10. Good, that showed up. Next, I wanna make sure it went to my inventory. So I'm gonna click on inventory and I can see that yes, I earned $50. It would have been 75 if I had gotten that other answer correctly, but I didn't. So it makes sense it's, that it is at 50. And that is how you add a questioner to your game. Thanks for watching.